There's a song that you wrote. I didn't know that you made it up. Plus, um, I like that song a lot. Uh, it's on world. Yeah, uh huh. Because you were singing it last week. I told you I like that. Now I like that song a lot. I got one I made up. I listen to it now. We just sing along. It's a good song. Because you know when you sing, you don't sing a song for very long at a time, then you sing another one. Yeah. That's a good one. If you make the song too long, it's become bored. Yeah, it does. Uh -huh. If you keep listening to it over and over, it's too long. So I guess it's good to have a short song. That's, I like that one. You got some poems in there that you know I agree in the first one of the 1920s, something like that. Yeah, I don't find most in it. Okay. And I think, well, I wasn't even born back then, you know, 1920. Well, 30 years before I was even born. I was born 1951. Yeah, I wrote a lot of poetry hmm. in my lifetime. You've been busy, you know, you did, you've done a lot. Yeah, you know, I. Ain't no way I'd do that much more. But most people don't even do that much, you know, for you know, do a lot player right up there. I might find the drum and play. You want me to kill it? You want me to go use your banjo? You don't need that again. Exactly. With it or without it. Oh. The pickup. Yeah. It's a better room in the house. You know, it's just closer in, but it's fine right there. Yeah. Well, uh, this is Howard Fester at Paradise Garden. Richard's here, and uh, he's enjoying this beautiful sunshine. He's been down in the garden where uh, tens of thousand roses are blooming. He's on his way to see his mother. And uh, he's also found a few pieces of my art to relax, and uh, I appreciate that. And uh, you know, best of your all time, Lily. And the apples and peaches is growing here, and the grapes and raspberries are getting ready to come out. And I want to bought a little song I sung down at the Museum the other day. Uh, the title of it is, I'm a Rising Up. Uh, when I was a young man, we were poor, and we didn't even have a corn stalk cutter. And on the farm, we had to pick up our corn stalks by hand. And then uh, we raised beans and peas and stuff. And I, I, got, I made this song up. I've been down to cornbread and peas. I've been down plumb on my knees. And now I'm a rising up, you know. So I made up a song and I sung that uh, down at the High Museum the other day. I'm a rising up. That's the title of the song. <clears throat> I'm a rising up. I'm a rising up high, cause I got my mind on the deep blue sky. I've been down, I've been down on my knees, Lord, I've been down. I've been down to cornbread and peas. I'm a rising up. Lord, I'm a rising up high, cause I got my mind on the deep blue sky. And that's one that I uh, made up, I'm rising up, you know, and uh, I rose up into about uh, 7,700 and some odd pieces of art, and uh, I come from cornbread and peas, uh, now I have tomato sandwiches with a little cheese on them now, you know. I'm rising up, you know, Richard. Uh, it's uh, getting higher and higher, you know. I had a little song I made up about uh, Jesus one time met a blind man. I don't know whether you've heard that or not. And uh, it says, 
Jesus one time met a blind man. He anointed his eyes with clay. And he sent him down to the waters. And the blindness all vanished away. Well, God can do that for you and you. God can do that for you. If you will be faithful to do what God said, then God can do that for you. <clears> oh, <throat> David, he was a young man. Well, he fought the mighty fight. He took his little hand sling and he slew the foolish Junjai. Well, God can do that for you and you. Well, God can do that for you. If you will be faithful to do what God said, then God can do that for you. And that song goes on now. And the several verses, you know, like the Hebrew children, they were taken, they were cast into the fire but God sent his angel and did not even singe their hair you know and it goes on it's just a wonderful uh, biblical song you know about the scriptures and uh, it's in a poetical form and I like it you know well uh, there's a we're watering the garden down there and the sun is shining out bright yeah uh, Everything uh, looking pretty here in Paradise Garden. And, uh, <coughs> yeah, Richard bought one of his uh, rugs he wove. He weaves, hand weaves floor rugs and he makes his own looms and things. And he's really a sharp guy here that uh, can do that. And uh, this rug, uh, thing about putting it up in the chapel here or in the studio where people can see it. And uh, where people have their address on their work, and uh, folks that come here looking for artists, art for sale, they can find where he makes rugs and sells them, and uh, and uh, they're beautiful, and they're hand woven, and the, the looms are handmade, and I think that's great uh, that he is a, a weaver and does his own weaving, makes his own machine. Yeah. Okay. Telephone. Yeah, that's the telephone.